over plans to evict them from their stalls. The raid traders say they were shocked to wake up in the morning only to find their stalls earmarked for demolition without any notice. Now, the traders claim they have nowhere else to put up their businesses and are calling on Governor James Nyoro to intervene. Adjacent to the Kiambu District Hospital mortuary lies the string of kiosks that have been the source of livelihoods for many traders selling coffins. Jo <laughs> Joseph Mugombugwa has been operating here since 1998, but things are taking a new turn for him and his family after he received an eviction notice from the county government. Iyo mea kayote tagia 1998 ni mekua hapa kiambu. Nikiuzia hapa kiambu hii karibu na mochari. Nimekua nikiuzia mageneza hapo. Sasa imekua aje. Nimekua wati mimi sijapata notice na ninashidwa kuwa ni kuna endere aje. Na nitaeda wapi. Many of these kiosks have been earmarked for demolition with the traders left puzzled over their next move during these trying times of the COVID-19 pandemic. Tumeka hapa kwa munda na sasa hii barua ilikuja jana. Tukabio 14 days tuwe tumetoka hapa. Sasa tunauliza hii fisarikari na venya hii tukana mzigo ya hii corona hii yenye imeingia. Tutaenda wapi? Kama saizi mimi niko hapa na mtoto na si mmoja niko na watoto wengine kwa nyumba. Na mi dio mama na mimi dio baba. Ombi letu ni moja. Wawachana watu wakiambu wafanya biyashara kwanza. Tusukumane na hii janga la COVID-19, si wakati wakuja kufuruga wanaichi ware wakochini sana. They are now calling on the county governor James Nyoro to intervene. Tuko wegi zaidi ya watu themanini mahali hapa tunafanya biyasara. So kuwabiwa tu uh, nilikuwa ninauliza jabo moja. Kama hili jabo governor wetu buwana Nyoro, Dr. Nyoro analifahamu. Ama wale wabuge, ama MCA wale wako mahali hapa. Kwa sababu wakati tulipa ochorewa mahali hapa, hatujaona watu wa wote wa bawa wamejitokesa kuja hapa kututetea sisi wafanyikasi biyasara hapa kiyabu. Na watu wakubwa wako huko, kama hii kitu inaitorewa hapa, ni mutu moja kona that interest. Na sita kubari hapa kiyambu. Ninaomba sana governor nyoro na kama unanisikia tafadhali. Kama tunataka kuongeza miradi hapa kiyambu, tusifanya biyashara na watu wale wako chini sana. Hizi vioski unawapa, unawana hapa, zinalisha watoto wengi sana. Wengine wamesomeshea hapa, mpaka wameenda primary, secondary, mpaka university, wakiwa hapa. Wakitoka hapa, wataenda wapi. Reporting for Channel 1 News, I'm Safin Aching Ouma.